Hey guys, so back at it with uh, the dating scene and going back and forth in your head whether or not to continue to date, to give it a shot, to, I don't know, it, it's so hectic out there. The dating scene is not what it used to be. I mean, I don't remember, it's been so many years, 25 years to be honest with you, that I had not dated anyone and then when you do go out on one date or two at the most, I think it was, and, you know, you just all skeptical. I mean, how do you, how do you overcome that, you know? How do you overcome the skepticism, the uh, wondering if this person is the same? I know, I know, it sounds terrible, but that's where I'm at, guys. That's where I'm at with this whole dating thing. And so, therefore, I'm just like... I don't know. I don't know what's gonna, you know, what's in the cards. Um, I just wish that I had the answers, and I don't. I, don't, I know I don't have the answers. The good Lord has the answers. But what do you do when you think that you're heading in one direction, and then all of a sudden something happens, and it kind of like throws you off guard because it changes the course of everything. So it's like. What now? I've been reading my Psalms. I've been reading my word to see if I can get some clarity from the Lord as to which way is my life headed now with this new twist. I call it a monkey wrench that was thrown into the mix. And um, what do you do? You know, what do you do when monkey wrenches get thrown into the mix and... Uh, you know, it's crazy. It's cra This whole thing is crazy, guys. And so, yeah, this is all, all post-divorce. After the divorce and after you... You know, it's not over. Once you get divorced or separated or broken up, it, it's not over. There's so much other things that happen and take place. And on top of it, you're healing yourself. You're working on yourself. And then on top of it, you got all these other things. Family, life, the job. You know, of course, your 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 walk with the with the Lord and your communication with Him, you know. And but nobody's perfect, nobody's perfect, and we're all gonna fall short. So it's kind of hard. And don't mind my hair, guys. I just got back from my walk, um, because here again, that's what helps me to keep it going. Drop a comment. Give me some advice. How you guys made it through your dating? Was it successful? Did you give up on dating? Come on, let's interact. Give me some comments. Watch this video to the end. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell so that you can get uh, future videos. And let's keep the communication going.